It's September 22nd. I'm Aaron Guy with a look at your news to go. The Palm Beach County School Board is set to finalize the COVID-19 emergency policy later on today. Now, some of those updates include quarantine guidelines and also allowing the superintendent to make changes to masks and other rules if necessary. Board members will also be discussing expanding COVID-19 test sites across the district. The meeting is expected to begin at 5 p.m. Also on the agenda for school board members, adopting its first policy to address the state's so-called Baker Act. The law, also known as Florida's Mental Health Act, lets law enforcement, judges, or mental health professionals have someone go through an involuntary mental health evaluation. According to the board's agenda, they're going to discuss changes like making sure school officials notify a student's parents or guardian before they're removed from school and taken to a mental health facility. And in our commitment 2021 coverage, Port St. Lucie voters have picked their next mayor. Vice Mayor and Veteran City Council member Shannon Martin won the special election with more than 65% of the vote. About 34% of the vote went to her challenger, Edgar Bernier, who is a St. Lucie County firefighter. Martin was already serving as interim mayor after former mayor Greg Orvecht resigned back in June. She will finish the rest of his term until November of next year. And another round of showers and thunderstorms will be returning to South Florida later this afternoon. Your seven day forecast highs near 86 degrees with a good chance of rain for today, tomorrow and the potential for minor flooding as well, at least through Friday. 40% coverage of rain on Saturday looking much better as we head into your Sunday, Monday and Tuesday with highs where we should be in the mid to upper 80s.